everybody. My name is Dr. Limesh. I am a consultant nephrologist and transplant physician at Narayan Rudalaya Bamsandra. Today, we will discuss about the renal transplantation. As we all know, the kidneys play a major role in the homeostasis of the body, where the functions of which include production of urine, electrolyte balances, production of hormones such as erythropoietin and vitamin D. When kidneys continue to fail, the, all these functions are lost in the body and the patient develops symptoms of kidney failure. In India, the most common cause for kidney failure is diabetes followed by hypertension and other causes such as glomerulonephritis and interstitial diseases. When the patient completely fails their kidney, when their kidney functions are less than 10%, we usually start with them on hemodialysis. Is that the end of the story for dialysis? No, we have other option what is called as kidney transplantation. Kidney transplantation is where the other human's kidneys are placed in the diseased kidneys, in the diseased kidney bodies. The, these kidneys can be procured either from the living donors which usually includes within the family or from the brain dead persons which usually we procure from the road traffic accident patients. This kidney transplantation is far far much better than the hemodialysis patient in terms of survivability and their quality of life. Also the kidneys as we understand that uh, plays a major role and when we place the kidney in the other bodies the body can, tends to reject the kidneys out of the body. So we have to start them on immunosuppression medications which has to be taken over lifelong period. These medications also have a good effect on the patient survival and other functions of the body. With this, the kidney transplantation is always the best option for the renal failure patients.